you know, we're talking to key decision makers, people who can make things happen yeah. uh, and bring deals in our, our way. Um, so it's always useful to have these kind of interactions. Yeah. Another useful uh, I, reason for being here is obviously to stimulate ideas. Sure around uh, what the market should look like and pipeline yeah. opportunities. From the markets that you operate in, the countries that you are where you are in, are, are deals all over the place? Are they flying all over you or you have to look hard and you know long to try and find the right kind of deals that fits the bank's profile? There are a lot of deals around. There's a lot of discussion, yeah. but it's more difficult to find those deals that are likely to, uh, that are well packaged right. because what we have in Africa is a shortage of development capital. Okay. What I mean by development capital is the patient capital required to package deals in right. a way that they are easily financeable. Right. Right. So, so, you know, there's a lot of uh, potential, yeah. but it takes more time to get the transactions to happen. What needs to be done to fix this? Is it, is it the fault of the government? Is it the fault of the bankers who are risk averse and are, are, you know, put in a lot of uh, uh, demands before they will sign on the dotted line? It takes a significant amount of coordination between government and the private sector. So yeah. government needs to put the policy in place, have the right uh, policy environment yeah. that allows banks to raise long-term capital. Okay. You also need the okay. developers who can make these deals happen. Yeah. Let's talk about where you are operating. Where are you seeing deals across Africa now? Of course, I know you. Yeah. You're not just uh, you know looking at Nigeria. Well, UBA Capital is the investment banking subsidiary of UBA Bank, yeah. and UBA uh, is is a bank that has a footprint across Africa. We're now in 18 countries, yeah. and we support um, our colleagues in the commercial bank wherever there's a transaction in any of these 18 countries. So sure. we, we follow UBA, UBA's footprint in a way. How, 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 how active are you now in terms of looking outside of Nigeria? Give me a sense of the, the, the project pipeline. Right, um, well, we, we have a very active uh, project pipeline. Uh, for instance, we're looking at hydro projects in Gabon, uh, where we've been working on a transaction for close to two years yeah. uh, and getting close to financial close. We're looking at uh, energy projects also in places like Uganda, Kenya, and in Tanzania, where we are today, uh, I'm also having some meetings with some potential clients there. So, you know, we're, we're active wherever the bank is active.